Hi guys and welcome to Educational Stock Analysis video for the day. So in this video, I'll be talking about Indus India Bank, M&M, Titan and ITC. So I'll be telling you the quick analysis and also I'll be sharing you if there is any event or news happening in this talks. Okay. So the first talk is Indus India Bank. So Indus India Bank, if you guys can see from the last six months, the stock has been growing in a very positive way and on 15th of Jan it made a high of 1688 and that was its main resistance point from there the stock has come down and now you can see it's trading somewhere around 1517 but this point is a very good point because around 1428 so you guys can see this point here okay so this point the stock has almost taken a support for three consecutive time and this level is very very important for indus india bank okay and a lot of researchers and analysts have said that this stock is a good stock okay and also this stock is well positioned for the growth okay and banks strong net interest margin indicates healthy profitability and Indus India Bank assets quality is also good, reflecting a good and robust portfolio. Okay, and please note this video is only for educational purpose. So whatever the stock I am telling you in this video is not, I am not asking you to trade on this or buy or sell. Okay, this is only for educational purpose and whatever I have read and whatever the information I have, I am just sharing you that thing. Okay, so Indus India Bank has already said you around 1693 it has made a high and from there it has come down and this level of 1434 to 1420 is very very important level for this stock okay so from here it has tried to gone up thrice and it has gone up till 1571 and right now it's trading at 1512 okay so if this 1571 levels gives a breakout then we can expect the stock to turn in a good bullish way again and also the market support will also matter if the market starts going up and then the Indus India Bank starts getting good kind of bias, then the stock has a good potential to perform. And overall, there's a good entry point and good potential for Indus India Bank. And again, I'm telling you that this video is only for a educational purpose. And as of now, there is no much news or any event on Indus India Bank. And also, guys, if you guys want to learn the concept of making consistent profit in intraday trading, you can join my personal and unique intraday trading course today. So in my course, I'll teach you the simple skills to make consistent profit, no indicators and no complicated things. The main goal of my course is to make you as a profitable trader with my strategies. I'll teach you the better strategies and better accurate strategies to make you a good trader and for you to make the possibilities of making good trades. Okay, so if you guys wish to learn from me and want to get personal guidance from me and also get the live market support from me, you can join us today. You can message me now on the WhatsApp number displayed on the screen to get in touch with me and to discuss with me. So with my years and years of experience, I'll be guiding you my best to make you as a good trader. Okay, and the next talk is M and M. Okay. So M and M, if you guys can see from the last six months, the stock has gone up almost 17.97% up. Okay. Even now also it's in a very much of a higher section. So the highest is around 19702 and you can see the 52 week high what it has made is 1982. Okay. So it's almost uh, trading uh, closely to that uh, 52 week high, almost 100 points down now. So now this stock has a news. Yes, so this stock has a news that M&M and Adani Total Energies have signed up for memorandum of understanding to set up EV charging infrastructure. So this is a news from M&M. Okay, so this stock is having a news and also you can see here this stock recent high is 19 one and from there it has come almost like 100 points down and now it has taken a good support around 1790 and yes as this stock is a good news this stock can perform as well so from the 52 week latest high 
it has come down 100 points so it has consolidated and now it is starting to go up again is what the view is and this is a news and event from m and m the next talk is titan so titan if you guys can see here from the last six months the stock is performing in a very good trend it is in a higher section even now also it's in a higher section and the 52 week high is around 3886 and currently it's trading around 3692 almost close to 3700 okay uh, but from the couple of uh, months you can see here the stock is in a downtrend okay so if you guys can see this level is a most important level for the stock that is somewhere around 3510 okay so somewhere around 3510 will become a very important level for titan so if this level breaks the stock can go into a bearish way but as the stock as having no news as of now but it does look good and this stock can perform in the upper side is what the view is and it can break the 52 week high if the lot has, if lot of buyers come in and if the stock perform in a good bullish way uh, but there is one small announcement from titan that this stock has got a credit rating of a1 plus and icra rating of triple a on march 21st of 2024 yes this is just an announcement and that's a good kind of announcement for titan is what i believe okay and the next news is from itc and itc also as you guys can see this stock you know this stock is good for a longer time frame so if you guys are planning to invest on this stock for a very very long term then you can expect some of the return but if you're looking for a short some a short term gain or something like that then this stock will not perform that much of in a volatile way as the other stock is what my view is so this stock's recent high point is around 481 from there the stock has come down till 400 and from here this has taken a support from the last couple of days the stock is continuously going in a bullish way from almost 408 to 430 continuous green candle has come in one day candle chart but if you see like last one week before the stock was continuously down for the last four to five days okay so this is how the itc is performing and there is no uh, much news in itc but there is one announcement which has come that is they have done an acquisition of share on international travel house limited and also on maharaja heritage resource limited so this is a latest announcement from itc so these are the announcement and news and quick analysis of this four stocks and please note this video is only for educational purpose and also you can go inside my channel to watch a lot of videos and educational knowledgeable videos so thank you guys so much for watching this video have a good day i'll see you in the next one very soon